you so far? Um, I feel like camp is going well. You know, I'm getting I'm getting closer with my teammates, uh, like learning the defense, getting more comfortable in it. You know, uh, just executing the calls and like tweaking out stuff I need to work on. But I feel like overall camp is going well. As a group, how do you think it's going? I feel like as a group, we all feed off each other. I think it's really going well. Uh, you know, especially DP being the older guy just since he's been in the program longer. Him, um, Aaron Witt, uh, John, uh, Nelly, Thomas, like we all just like talk to each other. We got like a brotherhood. We always hang out outside of the facility. Like, so we just always around each other. So I feel like it's going well for all of us. You got a, a new guy in your group with, with Ernest? Mm -hmm. a, little bit, a little bit bigger body than yeah. you normally would see at outside linebacker? Yeah, big Ern, big yeah. Ern. Yeah, he's uh he's coming along very well. Like he's uh picking up very fast, you know, especially because he played he play edge in high school. So uh, he likes it a lot. So like, you know, we just try to keep him, get him caught up to speed, you know, like teach him the ropes, but he's doing a very, very good job. I'm proud of, I'm proud of the, the steps he's taken to become like, uh, like he's been in the room, like he's like he's been there already. Feels like LaFellow's made some made some plays, especially mm -hmm. the last couple of days. What, what has stood out about his game for you? Uh, just his, his determination. He wants to play, and like he also he like he like he wants to win. So I feel like when you have that determination, you over, you can overcome anything. So just that will to want to play. So I feel like he's been like really like paying attention, like um picking up on the little details and taking coaching very well. Is there um, anything that surprised you coming into this program? Anything that player that stood out or? Um, it's not really anything surprising because I already knew how Coach Fickle was. Like he wants to win, so like just looking at his background, like I just I already knew. So I'm just like, like I just see like guys like Hunter Waller, like Rico, like Will Pauling, all those dudes. Like they how they attack every day, how they approach it. Like it makes you want to like be better because like like it's like a privilege to be on the field with those guys. So like you know like you don't want to let those guys down. The guys have been in the program. What it, what know what, what knows what it takes to win here. So like you know, just want to just do your job and just affect affect your position the way as much as you can. Can you talk a little bit about the tackles you guys go up against? Um, what what is it like facing Delson, Malman, and that group? Two two really good tackles that make me work every day. Like you gotta every day you gotta bring it with those dudes, or they're not gonna let you just like get out by them. They're gonna make you work. So like, I feel like at the end of the day, it's like you said, iron sharpen iron. So like uh, just makes both of us better. Like at the end, of the day, it's gonna help us win a lot of football games. How different is your role in this defense than what what you were at Syracuse? Uh, I feel like um, I have more feel, more freedom. Like I like to do what I like to do, rush the quarterback and be destructive um, in a run. Like versus at Syracuse, like you know, like I said, I played off the ball. Like um, like just really wasn't comfortable, but like, I learned. I wanted to learn because like, I wanted to play over there. But like here, it's just like the scheme just fits me perfectly, and I just I just love how they have me and have my role here. What did they sell you on the Badgers? Just they didn't really sell me anything. They just no like like. Like it's Wisconsin, like the dudes who played here, like like I said, actually this is a funny story. Coach Fick actually recruited me in high school for a tight end. I don't think he, I don't think he really remember. I have to remind him, but like my high school coach kept like cards and stuff like that. We had his car there, but like it, it's just funny because I already knew how Coach Fick was and stuff like that. And then Coach yeah. Mitch, uh, like I got the, got a chance on my official visit, get to know him more, talk to him, see how my role would be here, and like, I just like. I just knew that I would, I would like to come here and like be coached by him because like he coaches details and that's important for me. I want to work on my skill set and like just the little details that separate me from everybody else. What about the other guys in the room? Like, what was Peterson, Wade? Like, how were they when you when you first two, arrived? Two, two. So I didn't really get a chance to meet those guys um, when I was on my visit. I didn't, I didn't really met them when I first got a role, but when I got around those guys, I just see that very two hard workers, like funny dudes. Like we all, we all got just got, we all clicked as fast. Like so, especially like DP, like he's kind of the leader of the group, like because he's been here. So like you know, just, just, just tell us attack every day the same. Like we all got a job to do. Like just and have fun with it. So like I really respect that about him, and that just, like gives me energy. Like we all feed off each other, and just gives us keeps us going. You talk a little bit just about.